What is going on guys? Thank you all so much for tuning in. It is yet again my favorite time of the month. That's right, collection day. So I'm gonna go ahead and pack up my car with all this inventory you see back here. And then I am gonna go ahead and hit the road, service all my machines, collect the money that's inside. Hopefully we do pretty well. And uh, if you guys like this video, please make sure you hit that like button. It really helps out a lot. Just hit 700 subscribers at the time of making this. So I'm really stoked just about at that 1K mark. Hey guys, let's go ahead and pack up and hit the road. All right, so just pulled up the first spot. Uh, this one has been sitting here for about three weeks. Uh, before that, uh, I just placed it, so I have no idea what to expect here. Gonna do the first collection uh, to gauge how often I need to come here. Uh, so hopefully it does pretty well. Not really sure what to expect, uh, so let's go find out. All right, very cool. I uh, didn't open it up quite yet. I'll do that in just a second, but it feels pretty heavy for only three weeks. Uh, feels like there's got to be a good 30 bucks in here, so that's very exciting for only three weeks. Uh, also, cool news is they asked if I had any like chip machines or anything like that. So I told them I don't right now, but as soon as I get uh, my first full line machine, uh, I will bring it in for them and uh, give them some. Uh, like a full line chip and snack machine so I think that'll go pretty well considering uh, I feel like they did pretty well for the candy they definitely used pretty much all of them up quite a bit so it seems to be that all of them are good choices for this machine let's go ahead and open it up though So I counted all that up and I gotta say that was a killer gas, 30 bucks on the dot. Um, I did kind of drop some of it around my car. Uh, so it might have been a few extra quarters if I didn't get it all up, I'm not entirely sure. But I'm pretty sure I got most of it up. So give her uh, 30 bucks, uh, maybe 31. So right, right on my gas, pretty happy with that, especially it's only three weeks. And I uh, can't wait to get a chip machine in there. All right, just went to the next stop. Now this one had been sitting about two months, uh, so hopefully it's pretty decent. Definitely feels like there's over 40 bucks in here, so pretty happy. Uh, gonna go ahead and open it up and see exactly how much it ended up being. And one other thing that uh, I did need to uh, mention about the route is a lot of his candy wheels are open up just way too big. Now I'm all for giving the customer as much product as possible, but I still need to make a profit and the size that he had a lot of them open up to were just way too much uh, for you know how much candy that would come out. So let's go ahead and open this up and see how we did.
right, just got out of another location. Uh, I hit a few since uh, my last recording just because recording every location slows me down a tremendous amount. So I want to try to record some of them, but getting them all recorded is a little bit unpractical for me uh, just because it's going to take me way too long to do anything. But anyway, uh, I went in there and it was a decent location. It was like 25 bucks or whatever. It was like 25 bucks in there, not a bad location, but I realized on the gumball machine, the coin mechanism is broken and it allows backwards uh, free spin. So you spin it backwards and you automatically get a gumball for free without having to put a quarter in it. So I'll probably come back up here tomorrow uh, with another coin mech. I believe I have a replacement for it just to um, switch it out real quick. Only thing that kind of sucks is it's about 45 minutes away from my home. I wish I had known about it before I came up here today, but oh well, uh, you know, it is what it is. Going to go ahead and hit the next spot uh, and then come back up here, I believe, tomorrow to uh, stop giving away free gumballs. Wow, that was awesome. There was over $100 in that one gumball machine, $118.50 roughly. Now I gave them $18.50 for their cut, but I, I'm almost blown away. I expected like maybe 50, 60 bucks based on how he was talking about it, but over a hundred dollars that's insane for just one location with gumballs mind you so definitely gonna have to talk to them see if i can't get some more machines in there uh because that location's just amazing so it's really funny how vending is i went to the next stop uh now this one i know never does good but you know the shopping center over i had the gumball machine that made over a hundred dollars and then this one and that was just one month by the way and then this one had only five dollars for almost two full months so it just goes to show you that uh, results may uh, vary very wildly so you know it's all about just getting as many locations as you can uh, because eventually you're gonna have some that are just absolute home runs like that one uh, but at the same time you're definitely gonna have some pretty bad locations like uh, this one right here. All right, just got out of the next place. Uh, there was 68 bucks in it. There's actually two machines in there. Uh, and then I gave them their cut of 1025. So I walk out with 57.75, pretty happy with that. And while I was there, I actually have a standalone rack uh, that I bought a while back. I did a video on it uh, quite a while ago actually, but I asked if I could put that in there. And I said I'd give him the same cut as the other machines that I already uh, am taking care of. And he said, yeah, sure, go for it. So going to go ahead and bring that machine in there. Got uh, my rack uh, location secured, which is pretty good because it's at my mom's house. And they kind of wanted it going by spring uh, for spring cleaning. So perfect timing. Uh, pretty excited to see if I can't maybe get that in here today. We'll just have to see, though. All right, just got home. Uh, here is all the change right here. As you can see, it is completely full. <laughs> um, gonna go ahead and count that up for you all in just a second. I'll show you it's like all the way to the top here. So you can't even like fit any more in there. So my guess is it's probably around like 400 bucks. Um, not sure exactly how much, but I feel like that's a pretty close estimate. So I'm gonna go ahead and count everything up for you all, and then I'll, I'll let you know how much I made from the route today. And then I also have to go ahead and collect uh, several more machines on Friday. And then on Monday, I'm going to have a few more to collect as well. So this is all of, well, a good chunk of my locations. This is most of my better locations. Um, I'm thinking I might be able to pull out another 
maybe 200 from the remainder of my machines. I'm not sure. Uh, I would be pretty happy with that, but maybe not quite that much. We'll just have to see. Anyway, guys, uh, that's going to pretty much wrap up this video. So if you like these collection videos, please make sure you hit that like button. It really helps out a lot. Uh, and then subscribe if you haven't already. And I will catch you all in the next one.